Hello again, my pretties. So it is now face it time. face it for those who don't know, is a Korean skincare, well, skin sheet mask. Sorry, sheet mask. Uh, subscription. Um, I do love this because this is cheaper and more convenient for me. They have, let's see, they're Forever Fresh, which I am uh, subscribed to. You get four sheet masks a month for $5.99 plus $2.95 shipping and handling, which comes out to $8.90 for me. Cheaper than going to the store and trying to figure out which one works for me. I have, you know, my profile set with Faceatory and they give me what they feel as though my skin needs. They also have the Seven Lux subscription, which is like fifteen ninety nine ninety five, something like that. Uh, and that's more luxury cheap masks, and you get seven of them. I do not need seven like I have a ton as it is I only use once a week so this is the best bank for my buck I know they were starting a new subscription you know it has some skincare moisturizers chemical um, clay mask you know to go with it that's like a whopping $33. I wish I could try that. I just, I can't right now. Maybe if I got one or maybe if they had like a special bundle, you know, I would give that a try. But I do love my sheet mask. I love that I freak out my husband and I tend to do my sheet mask on a Wednesday. So I call that leather face Wednesdays, you know. And like when I get in bed and he's like, do you have your face on? And he looks at me, he goes like, oh no, no, it's not a face night. Okay. But that's how my household goes. Let's see. This month, little, they've been putting these little postcards in, in the face of Tori you know, subscriptions, which is really cute. I don't know when I would actually send this out, but it would make a really good Instagram picture. Uh, but this says super fruits for a super you. Here is the little card that shows you all your items here. And it says, April forever fresh. The sky is clear and the flowers are blooming. This month, we'll focus on feeding your skin with the right nutrients, vitamins, and antioxidants found in different fruits and botanicals. So it's very fruit-based, very natural, sort of. All right. Here is my first one. This is the Faceatory brand. It is Let's Talk Vitality Firming Mask. It says skin in need of a lift. Let's talk vitality. This firming mask uses antioxidant rich punica granite granitum fruit extract, which is pomegranate, and moisturizing shea butter, ooh, shea butter, to turn tired, a tired complexion into plump hydrated skin, which is good for me. All right, here's the next one, the Hello Ganic. One a day water mask. 
never heard of this brand. Ooh, they're vegan. Natural and organic sheet mask. Hmm. It says filled with coconut and rose water. Oh, two of my favorites. This sheet mask will help add water moisture to your skin. It's natural, organic, and vegan. That is different, that is interesting. And it says, you know, ingredients, coconut and rose water. And this is the material is eucalyptus sheet. How does that work? I don't know. I'm really, really interested in how, what this looks like and how my skin is gonna react. That is, yeah. I keep dropping everything. All right, my next one is from 24 Miracle. It is the vitamin facial mask with whole lemon mask. These are Korean. A lot of the packaging has another language on it. So the translation is not always the best. That says this mask is great for controlling excess oil. That's me. That's what I have, especially now that it's getting warmer, my skin will tend to get oilier. And hyperpigmentation, again, me. I have that on my forehead from, you know, being careless when I was younger and not putting sunscreen on. And I have a large forehead. Your skin will be left feeling more invigorated and supple. This has lemon extract and sodium hyaluronate. Not as interesting as the second sheet mask, to be honest. All right. And my last one is from Moksha Dear Avocado Mask. Says this creamy mask is a great option for a relaxing night in. This sheet mask will leave your skin hydrated and as smooth as velvet. As avocado and mango and apparently banana and lavender. I don't even. I like. I like to eat avocados. I don't know about putting avocado on my face though, but it is a super fruit. It's great if you have like high cholesterol, you can use that avocado and it's all the good fats and not the bad. It's delicious, but that's about it. And then they have some tips at the bottom. It says, do not leave your mask on for more than 30 minutes. That kind of defeats the whole purpose. You know, if it's drying out by then. Use the remaining essence to moisturize the neck and the shoulders, which I do. Sometimes in the mask, in the packet, there is a lot of excess essence, as they call it. Um, so, you know, I try to put it wherever I can. Um, I also have bottled up the essence, put it in the fridge and it's in a spray bottle. And so like, I kind of use that as an additional serum in the morning. Yeah, that's just me. And then it says, make sure to apply a moisturizer to lock in essence from the mask. I do that as well. I use a sleeping mask. 
you know, I used the one that I got from, I think it was Fat Fit Fun, the Ahava sleeping mask, you know. But that's it. What do you guys think? I am most intrigued by the vegan one. I hope it's not white. I hope it's a weird one. I would, when I finally get to this one, since I do have a plethora, um, I will, uh, if it's, you know, something different, I will take a picture and I will post that. But that's about it. Have a good day. I'll see you in the next one. And don't forget about that giveaway. You still have plenty of time. Bye.